On this mixture, we will have to add, again, a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, actually quite a lot of pepper, olive oil, and the condimento morbido. Don't be scared. So I go back to the bread, the one who's been into the actual water for a long time. I really squeeze all the water out and I get like a, like, you know, like broken one. And off I go with my hands. I'm gonna turn it around. Be careful to not over wet it. The most important thing when you do that is to actually taste it. I'm happy with that. Should I taste it? Yes, please do. Thank you, good idea. Oh. Okay. Mm. I put a touch more of vinegar and a touch more of oil. I must say it's really interesting how much difference the vinegar makes. To it. It really, it's, it's quite, quite sweet vinegar. It's quite a sweet vinegar. But it adds that little touch of acidity. Yeah. I, will, I love a lot of basil in it. Not so bad, because that gives it a real flavour yeah, of summer. Whenever you ban, whenever you, you, you actually bite into a leaf, that you will get really this sensation. So, as you can see, so it, it's all wet, but there is no extra, extra sort of liquid left at, at the bottom of it. So it is wet, but it's okay. All right? Okay. Needless to say, then we could just do anything you want and add anything you want into that. It will, be that about, it will be about like now four or five minutes, the sardine are cooking, so we are ready. So we're gonna put a little bit of rocket and again, a bit of pepper and a bit of salt, shaking, which is uh, olive oil and lemon in here. And that's okay. olive oil and lemon juice. And lemon juice. Okay, we're going to give him a stir. Are we going to put that underneath? Would you call this a restaurant, a restaurant dish? Uh, yeah, it could be a home dish as well. I don't know. You see, it's like... A and this should, ideally should be made about, what, a few hours beforehand? A few hours before, or not, not the night before, otherwise it gets very mushy. Because you know, the idea is the contrast that you have between having those lovely pieces of bread and they are still crunchy, and the one that they are already... Is, the, is it... Will come off? I will just put them on top. This is a restaurant dish. Come on, Giorgio. I mean, anything that looks as beautiful as that. I don't know, in my house we eat like that. I don't know if in your eyes you don't eat like that, that's your problem. Yeah. <laughs> Fantastic, Giorgio. Give us the full title. Sardine with panzanella, as simple as that. <laughs> <laughs> if you fancy making Giorgio's sardine dish, you need to buy some fresh sardines, extra virgin olive oil and lemon. For the panzanella, you need some good quality stale bread and sweet white wine vinegar. Pick up some cherry tomatoes, a red onion, a large bunch of basil and some rocket and make some lemon oil dressing to finish.